Welcome to Stump the Scientist. And we're here with our Chief Scientist, Jim Bray, to answer a question from Rohan submitted via Facebook. Jim, is wireless power transmission possible? What do you think? Okay, Andrew, we'll take that question. The answer to Rohan's question is yes, which can be a surprise to those who are used to plugging wires into the electric socket and getting the power for their device that way. We can do it without wires, wirelessly. Now, this happens all the time when we're using common devices like cell phones or radios or TVs with antennas. A little bit of power is being transmitted from the transmitting station to the receiver, but the purpose of this is not to give power to the device, but to carry the communications to the device. But nevertheless, a little bit of power is being transmitted. So Rohan's question is going to the point of can we carry a lot of power this way from the transmitter to the receiver? And the answer to that is yes also, and we use the same technique. We have electromagnetic radiation or photons that carries the power from the transmitter to the receiver, and we increase that power flow a lot, and we can bring a lot of power over to the receiving device. The problem is that as the power is transmitted, it goes in other directions other than to the receiver, and so if they're very far apart, we can't transmit very much power very efficiently. So they have to be fairly close together, let's say a foot or so, when we want to transmit a lot of power from transmitter to receiver. But we can do it, and it's an area of active research now. In fact, there's a small company called Ytricity that is experimenting with doing this commercially now. When might we want to do this? Well, in situations where it's difficult to plug wires in. This technique will never be as efficient as a wired connection, but in some situations, like when we want to give power to a mobile device, or give power in situations where it's very difficult to plug wires in, it can be a big advantage. And so I expect to see this technology used more in the future. Good question, Rohan.